the scheme we've devised, and thus the term superlinear, um, has some strong, and I would even say counterintuitive properties. The most important of these is what we call superlinear staking impact. Specifically, we believe we have a practical design that gets us quadratic staking impact. Let, let me explain what I mean by this. Imagine you've got an Oracle network with say 10 nodes and each of them stakes a million dollars. You would think that an adversary could bribe all 10 nodes and get them to emit an incorrect report with a total budget of just over $10 million, right? The idea is pay each node just over a million dollars to lie in its next report. Right? That 10 times $1 million is $10 million. But in our staking mechanism design, an adversary would actually instead need 100 million. That's, as I said, we get quadratic staking impact. That's 10 squared times 1 million. And with a bigger network, it gets even better. If there are, say, 35 nodes, an adversary would need not 35 million, but 35 squared times a million, which is a little over a billion. As I said, this is pretty counterintuitive. It's a result that surprised me, I think surprised all of us, and it has important implications. It means that an Oracle network can achieve more economic security than there are deposited funds. In other words, you get real bang for your buck in terms of economic security. It also means that the bigger an Oracle network gets, the more the cost of economic security drops. There's a strong economy of scale. 